Johnny Humphrey. Um, I have Johnny 99 Customs. I'm from uh, Terry Hill, Pennsylvania. This is a 1967 uh, original Harley Sportster engine. Um, it's all Harley. It has um, Andrew Y cams, I believe, in it. Opened up the other side, has a belt drive on it. Um, that I guess was normally for the Sportsters. It should be internal, but it's external now. It's kind of a pain, but it worked out. Harley Rapido, I believe, gas tanks. Um, most of it, I wanted to try and stick to Sportster stuff with the, the motor. So like the rear fender was an actual Sportster fender. The oil tank was a Sportster tank that I ended up modifying and sinking it back into the, the post and uh, relieving it for the chain. Um, just has a bunch of cool little stuff. It's nothing over the top. Uh, like the integrated the pegs into the actual kicker cover and the, the chain cover is all one piece. Like when that comes off, everything, and then you can remove your your uh, shifter arm. The exhaust is all put over to the other side because there was already so much going on on this side. So that side, other than the belt drive, really didn't have anything over there. So um, I wanted to make sure I could try and balance it out so that everything worked out. What it started with was actually just the engine. What I actually salvaged out of that engine was three rocker boxes, the cams, the cam cover, and the belt drive. I learned a lot about Sportsters quickly. They're not bad to work on, it's just not my preference, but thankfully I had some good people around me. Growing up, I've tinkered with things my whole entire life. Motorcycles have always been something that, that we've grown up around. I put the Makuni on it and spent the time learning how a Makuni set up and being able to change the slide and all kinds of stuff that you can do with a Makuni. It, it's night and day. It is night and day on how this bike runs. I mean, it is, it's actually fun now. I, I kind of like a sportster. <laughs> I'll take it, I'll say it. I like it. Right.